Hi, can I just get some cheese melt dippers, please? Okay, so update on the crumpet. So I just picked up these. This is what I was looking for, these pots and blankets. You saved me from tears. I don't think I can do this with you in the room. <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel and I post videos every single Wednesday and Sunday. So make sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification to get notified every single time that I do upload a video. So for today's video, as you've seen from the title, I'm going to be eating Christmas food for 24 hours. So I've actually already filmed this video, but I completely forgot to do a intro and an outro for it. So here we are, doing it now. I think I did this video last year, I can't remember. Um, but I was planning to do this video for so long and everyone seems to have uploaded this video like, you know, earlier in December. But, you know, here I am, I'm uploading it now. As always, if you do like videos like this, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Remember to subscribe if you haven't already. And let's just get started. So, for my breakfast, I am going with the classic reindeer-shaped crumpets because everyone seems to use these for their breakfast. And I simply just couldn't think of anything else to get. And these are actually the first time I've seen these in Asda. I remember I tried doing this video, I think it was last year. And I couldn't find these anywhere. I think they must have all sold out. But there were so many this year. So this is going to be my breakfast. I think I'm going to have one to start with. Because it is quite early. And I'm not really a massive breakfast person at the best of times. So I'm going to have one. Put some butter on it. And yeah. But they do look so cute. cute and that my friends is my breakfast so i'm just gonna take this back upstairs um get back into bed because that's what i always do and pop an emmerdale on and i'll let you know what i think of it and then i shall see you again at lunchtime okay so update on the crumpet i really didn't like it i ate it because like i had to because it was breakfast but i really didn't like it i don't think i like crumpets like no nah, it just wasn't for me i mean I'm, I'm not really a breakfast person anyway and it was quite early this morning i think i ate at like eight o'clock or half eight or something like that so yeah i wasn't a fan of the crumpet but i'm hoping that you know lunch will be nicer to be fair i'm actually not that hungry at all so i'm gonna go off and get my lunch now yeah like i said i'm not that hungry so i'm just gonna go and get something really small so i'm gonna head off to mcdonald's for my lunch because i want to get something from their christmas menu because obviously as you saw my last video i did try the christmas like part of the christmas menu there and i really want the cheese melt dippers again so i'm gonna go and get them i think oh god this camera okay i'm not gonna be able to do a drive with me because like i said in my last weekly vlog i can't attach my camera to my tripod that i have in my car my car mount um so i'm gonna have to flip onto my phone and film just for this little section because like i said it doesn't fit which is really sad because you know i want it to fit so i need to buy a new car mount for this camera i don't know how i'm gonna do it but you know I will find one um but yeah let's go to mcdonald's this obviously still counts as christmas food because it's the christmas menu you know so that's fine i'm sure it is um i would love to try something else from their christmas menu but it's all meat and i don't really want to eat meat just for the sake of it like when i don't need to so i'm not gonna do that but i'm just gonna get the cheese melt dippers because oh god they are so good i actually tried the nacho ones um the other week and i thought they were horrific like i really did not like them at all oh my god these lights take so long oh thank you my turn oh god the queue looks so long hi can i just get some cheese melt dippers please cheese melt dippers yes please She's probably thinking, is that it? So I have got my cheese melt dippers. Here they are. It's just so sad that you only get four. Like I do think for like £1.89, you should get more. And here is my tangy tomato dip. I actually do love this dip. I don't normally have dips with like my McDonald's ever. But this one, this one hits different. Oh, okay, here we go. just as good as last time they're so good cannot get enough of these i'm gonna be so sad when these go off the menu because they're so good i've got some christmas snacks as well at home so that's gonna be like my other section of my lunch because like i said i'm not that hungry so this is perfect mm. Oh my god, I've been rolling the entire time. I didn't have my handbrake up. No, 
finished them. I'm so sad. They were so good. I should probably get the share box next time, actually, because then you get 12. And that would be more than enough. So I think I might do that next time. Okay, so the first part of my lunch is done. And now I'm going to go home and have some Christmas snacks. Right, let's go. Okay, so I've just got home and Sophie's actually just made some gingerbread cookies, which is perfect timing for this video. And guys, if you could smell them, like the smell of gingerbread is insane. Like, I know some people don't like gingerbread, but I absolutely love it. So I'm gonna have one of these and I'm so excited. They smell so, so good. Okay, right, taste test, what do you think? Mmm, they're mm. so good. They've got just all like, um, chocolate pieces too so it's like gingerbread and chocolate so so good you know what they taste really good though like right out of the oven you know when they're like literally break apart in your hand i don't like that do you know what? no i prefer like, you know like a cookie like you get from the shop yeah i prefer it like that really I no i prefer it when it's like really like gooey the domino's cookies domino's cookies too that they literally fall apart in your hand well you so want good. them tonight really nice mm. This is what they look like inside. So good, a mixture of chocolate chip and gingerbread. So, so good. So then something else I'm gonna try as well is these Jacob's Cracker Crisps. I got these in the like seasonal section in Asda. Like I literally just went to the aisle and it said seasonal and it was, oh God, Sophie, you're taking the mick now. Sorry. And they just had these in there. So, you know, I guess they are Christmassy. You do have crackers at Christmas, I suppose. So these are sour cream and chai flavor, which I know I'm gonna love because I love sour cream so much. So me and Sophie are gonna try these now and let you know what we think of them. So this is them. This is what they look like inside. And they're just like little mini like cracker pieces. The lighting's so yellow here, I do apologize. I don't know if I like smell of them as well. Really? The they're like the Pringles. Oh, God, mm. they're strong. They're nice. Mmm. Mm. Do you like it or not? No. <sighs> I don't know. They're quite, they are nice, but they're quite strong. See, I don't think they're that strong. Really? Didn't you they're nice, the but... Like tingles. Really? Mmm. Really? These are really good. I could sit and snack on these easily. They're mini chips. I love them. They're so good. They're only a pound, I think, as well. That's pretty decent. Right, so it means they are just going to go off to... Um, Sainsbury's now to go and get my dinner because I forgot to get it the other day and I need to obviously go and get it now because I need dinner um, well not soon the time is like four o'clock now I think but I need to go and get my dinner and see what I can actually get because I really really have struggled to like find some ideas um, actually like for dinner I just can't decide like and I obviously don't want to get meat so all oh, the lighting is a bit funky but you know yeah so we're gonna go off to we're gonna go off to Sainsbury's and see what I can find basically. So I just picked up these, this is what I was looking for, these pots and blankets. Um, they're vegan and yeah, they sound good. I should have this for Christmas dinner so it'd be like actual Christmas dinner. Mm -hmm. What else can I get? What's that? Uh, no turkey parcels. Oh, this, oh, there's so many things I could have for Christmas. Turkey saving parcels stuck filled what with sage it? and onion stuffing. Wrapped oh, in. nice. It's basically turkey and bacon. Is it? Yeah. Maybe I should get that instead then. I don't know. I could also get some stuffing as well. What's that? Sage and onion stuffing balls. Mmm, that sounds quite nice to be fair. And what's the, and there's a bit, no beef wellington over there as yeah. well. Oh my god, I've got so much to choose from. I came for these to yeah. be fair, didn't I? Yeah. I think I'll get these. I think I want some Yorkshire puddings too. Unpopular opinion, but I prefer a Christmas dinner with Yorkshire puddings. that was a success so I got the pups in blankets so that's gonna be you know part of my Christmas oh whoa. sorry that's gonna be part of my you know Christmas dinner that's what did I even say that's what I'm having basically like a mini Christmas dinner I'm having um, and then I just picked up some vegetable gravy because we didn't have any and then I also picked up some Yorkshire puddings and you might be thinking Isabel they're not part of a Christmas dinner but for me they are like I love Yorkshire puddings on Christmas so you know it might not be the traditional Christmas dinner but that is what I enjoy the lighting looks so weird but I've just put my pups in blankets out on my tray and they go in the oven I think it's for 14 minutes so yeah I'm gonna put them in now I've only done half because I don't really know like if I'm gonna like them or not so I didn't think there's any point you know wasting them so they're gonna go in the oven for 14 minutes and then I'm also gonna pop my Yorkshire puddings in and then I'm going to 
what do I need to do? Oh, I need to cook my broccoli and then do my gravy. And I'm actually so excited for this like mini Christmas dinner. So here it is, my mini little Christmas dinner. So these are the pups in blankets and I think they've turned out so nice. They actually smell really nice to be fair. Um, and then I've obviously got my Yorkshire puddings and my gravy, not my gravy, my, um, my broccoli. And then I've also got my gravy here. So I'm gonna pop that on top and do a taste test. Okay, my head is like nearly cut off, but you know, that's fine. Oh, I've got gravy all over my fork, lovely. So again, here's my dinner. And I'm actually pretty impressed with this because, you know, I'm not a chef um, by all means. So, you know, I mean, all I did really was put everything in the oven, but you know, here we go. Okay, let's give these sausages a taste test. Guys, they taste so good. That is so nice. Oh my God. I can't go over how nice they are. Oh my God, they're so nice. Okay, let's have a Yorkshire pudding. Mm, honestly, I know Yorkshires aren't supposed to technically be in a Christmas dinner, but they, they're so good. I can't not have them for Christmas. I am so impressed with myself. So yeah, now I'm just gonna do a time lapse of me, you know, eating my dinner because I'm starving. And yeah, this is, this is my Christmas dinner. So I've just finished all my dinner and oh my god, that was so good. Like I am definitely going to have those vegan pigs and blankets on Christmas day now because they are so good. And I was wondering what I was actually going to eat on Christmas day because I didn't want to I didn't want to have to eat meat. I thought I had no other choice. But now I have found something that I can have. So they are so so good. I'm really happy about them. Like I said, they're just from Sainsbury's. Um and they've got like it's in like a little um like vegan Christmas section and they're so so good. So that pretty much is my day of eating Christmas food complete because that has filled me up a lot. It didn't look a lot, but it was really really filling. So I feel like I've had a very very successful day. So that is the end of my 24 hours eating Christmas food. I actually had such a fun day eating this food. Obviously, I'm filming this outro on a different day, um, and I've already filmed the video, and it was so much fun. Like, I found some really good stuff, I think, and that Christmas dinner, I thought was amazing. You know, it was only a mini one. Obviously, there was a lot missing, and it really didn't look that appetizing, but I can assure you it was so good. So I'm really happy I found those pigs and blankets too because I'm definitely going to have them on Christmas Day. And there's a few other things I found in Sainsbury's actually that I'm probably going to have on Christmas Day as well. When this video goes up, it's like four or five days until Christmas. So that's exciting. So if you're watching this on Christmas Day or near Christmas, I hope you guys do have a lovely Christmas. And obviously I'll be having a video go up on Wednesday. And I'm also going to be vlogging Christmas Day. As always, this will be the third year in a row that I vlog Christmas Day, which is crazy. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did like it, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Remember to subscribe if you haven't already. And I shall see you soon for another video. Bye.